everybody, this is Brandon down here at Snake River Fly Shop. Um, coming at you today with a little short video. Uh, we're gonna talk about feraling materials. It's a question we get asked a lot and sometimes referencing back some, to our, some of our other videos kind of be a pain in the butt. So I just wanted to do a quick up close and personal kind of deal here just to show you, um, you know, and this is a, a method that you can use for just about any style like chenille, anything that kind of comes on a rope or a string, right? And so. I have some of our black techno bunny here, and what I'll do is I'll take one end of that, and I'm just gonna kind of mash it down. All right, this is gonna be waste. This is gonna allow me to get some grip. Okay, and I'm right-handed, so on my left hand, I'm gonna take the material and I'm gonna pinch it tight, all right? And with my, uh, my right hand here, I'm gonna come in and that part that I kind of matted down, and I'm just gonna think about like you're rolling dubbing on a, uh, you know, on your thread, you know, that noodle dub style. We're just gonna roll that. See how it wants to come on itself here. And now I'm gonna take this hand without, you know, pinching tight on both ends. I'm gonna come in and I'm gonna pinch that there like so. And then bring my right hand back in again. Roll it again, come back in like so. And I'm just gonna rinse and repeat that step over and over until I get it as tight as I'd like it. And what we're doing by spinning this is it's gonna force this material to wanna to wrap back up on itself and create you know, extended bodies and stuff like that. And so now I'm happy with how tight I have this. I'm going to now transfer. You can see it already wants to kind of spin up on itself. I'm gonna take my middle finger here and put it right in the middle, fold it over, and then transfer it to my right hand here and pinch. I'm gonna let go of that and now it wants to spin up. I'm gonna twist that back and I could come in, brush this out and get it all fluffy. But now you can see my two materials here. And the cool thing I like about the Techno is you can prep a bunch of these, say you're tying in you know, tube socks or whatever it is, prep a bunch of these up and have them ready to rock and roll in different lengths or for whatever you're looking for. But just to show you there, you can do it with hydro. And like I said, just about any other chenille. So that's just a quick breakdown on how to ferrule materials. You can find this on our website or on YouTube. And we appreciate you watching. Thank you.